In this video, I'm going to show you how to download Optifine for the Copper Age update. The first thing you want to do is you want to go to the link in the description down below and in the pinned comment, where it is going to provide you with a written step-by-step -step guide along with all the necessary tools and files that you will need. So step number one is to download Optifine. So underneath step number one, you should find this link over here. So you should see this link over here that says Optifine official website. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on it just like so. Then it is going to take you to the official Optifine website. From here, go ahead and select on downloads on the top. And I'm actually recording this video a couple hours before the update comes out. But by the time you're watching this video, you should see the option that says Minecraft 1.21.9. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and click on it. Then you want to go ahead and press on download. So I'm going to be doing this for Minecraft 1.21.8. That being said, the process is going to be the exact same thing. So all you want to do is you want to press on download just like so. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and just wait for this timer to actually load in. So don't click on anything. All you need to do is you need to go ahead and wait until you see this option that says skip. Then afterwards, go ahead and press on download. And while that's downloading, let me tell you guys about Symbol Game Hosting. Symbol Game Hosting offers affordable and high quality Minecraft server hosting where you're easily able to set up a unlimited slot 24 seven server for you and all your friends. The Copper Age update introduces a bunch of new game mechanics. And with Symbol Game Hosting, you're easily able to play multiplayer with you and all your friends to enjoy this new update. They make everything incredibly easy to set up from their dozens of video tutorials along with 24 seven live customer support where you can have a Minecraft server expert walk you through the entire process. You can also add things like mods, mod packs, plugins, etc. with the click of a single button. And at the moment, they're currently doing a sale where everybody who gets a Minecraft server gets 25% off their very first month of server hosting. So if that sounds interesting, feel free to check out the link in the description down below and in the pinned comment. All right, guys, that's enough yapping out of me. So the next thing you want to do is you want to drag and drop the Omnifine file to your desktop just like so. Then afterwards, you want to go ahead and return back to the website and go to step number two, which is arguably the most important step, and that is to download Java. So underneath step number two, you're going to see this option that says Java 21 download. So if you haven't already, you need to install Java 21 in order for this to work. So it is going to bring you to a website that looks like this and make sure that JDK 21 is selected. Then over here, please go ahead and select on your operating system. So me personally, I'm running on a Windows. So I will go ahead and press on this. Then I will install the x64 installer right over here. And it is going to walk you through the entire setup wizard. It's incredibly easy to download and you may need to restart your PC in order for Optifine to be applied. So again, just keep that in mind, but this is where you would go in order to download Java if you haven't already. Okay, so now that you install Java, here's what we need to do. We need to return back to the desktop and we need to locate the Optifine file. Now, what you wanna do is you wanna right click on it and press on open with. And if you did install Java, then you're gonna see this option that says Java TM platform SE binary. And all you wanna do is you wanna go ahead and press on it just like so. Then you're gonna get something that looks like this and just go ahead and press on install. Then it is gonna say Optifine is successfully installed. And once you see that, go ahead and press on okay. And then from here, open up the Minecraft launcher like you normally would. Once you're here in Minecraft, make sure that Java edition is selected. Then go over here to where it says installations and where it says versions, please make sure that the box that says modded is turned on because this is technically considered a modded version of Minecraft. And then from here, you should see this option that says Optifine. So yep, here it is. And then from here, all you want to do is you want to press on play, press on I understand, then go ahead and press on play one more time. All right, guys, so here we are in Minecraft. So it is going to say modded right over here. And then from here, you can go ahead and begin playing Minecraft with Optifine and get a better performance boost. You guys could also download shaders, mods, etc. thanks to Optifine. So from here, you can go ahead and have a ton of fun. If you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial.